all-time great Joe Smith. You just saw what could have been an instant classic. It went well for Maryland. What are your high points of the game for Maryland as they took it down the stretch over Belmont? I mean, I think in the second half they came out with a lot more energy, a little more energetic. Uh, they came out pushing up on the ball. They started attacking the basket a lot more and stopped settling for a lot of threes. And I think that, that got, a, got the momentum in their favor in the second half. The first half, it was kind of back and forth. You know, uh, Belmont did a great job of coming out and uh, knocking down a lot of three-pointers. But I think in the second half, we really got our, our legs up under us. I think number three for Belmont got tired for a minute. I said that at the end. I said he shot his load. He got tired. The same shots that you take, that you knocked down in the first half and early in the second half. You know they, they get a lot tougher later in the, later in the game, especially when you got a hand in your face. So he got a little bit tired. The defense picked up a little bit more, and you know it, it was a good win. Sticks looked like Joe Smith for two <laughs> minutes there. He was he was making shots. He wasn't shooting. He went up for a rebound and knocked it in by accident. Yeah, I mean. So being active, sometimes you get you get plays like that. Just being active, being around the basket, being active, you know, keeping your hands, you know, uh, going after that ball. Sometimes you make plays like that, and you know, I, I had some lucky plays like that in my career too. So I understand. Well, there's lucky and good, and however you get it, Maryland wins it. They're yes. going to take on LSU on Saturday. We love to play another day, a day. Joe Smith, thanks for being on Turp Talk, and go Terps. Oh, uh, go Terps, and no problem. Thanks for having me. This is Mason Viner. Listen to the Young Terps podcast on CapitalSportsBlog.com and TerpTalk.com, the number one rated Maryland sports podcast. NPS Nonprofit Services has the technology and know-how to achieve your nonprofit goals. We have all the tools that you need for your nonprofit to be successful, including tech support, consulting, development strategies, and business continuity to make sure your data is safe on-prem or in the cloud anywhere all the time. Call NPS at 877-797-8776. We're easy to reach and easy to work with. This is the Viner Four Gates postgame show here live in Jacksonville on a Thursday. Boy, that's a way to kick off the weekend. Maryland pulls it out. It was close. It was tough. Belmont was pretty good. And that number three for Belmont sure could shoot the ball. Maryland ends up uh, with some good rebounds. They played the inside game. You heard from Joe Smith. If you haven't, you will in a second. Very, very impressed with the heart Maryland showed. This is the type of win that we've been waiting for where you could have folded up, you could have had it, the season could have been over, you decided that it wasn't going to be today. So we live to play again. We're going to get LSU. They have a huge back line. SEC tested. They're pretty tough. It'll be Saturday. Thank goodness we get to play again on Saturday. Mason and Bruce are away from the camera this afternoon. Hopefully we'll get everybody down here on Saturday in Jacksonville. Great day to be a Terp. Thanks to Meyer Consulting Engineers. Of course, Viner Forgates, our home team sponsor. If you need technology, call Viner Forgates at 301 251 2900. They will make your business run better. Maryland over Belmont. We live to play again. This is Wayne Viner in Jacksonville.